Hi everyone, this is Debbie and I'm sorry that I'm not showing my face on this, but I'm going to show you my current Pandora collection and I think it's easier to do it this way because I can show you the detail of each uh, little piece. This is a traveling case that uh, I believe it was a gift of purchase or maybe had uh, my husband paid a little bit for it. I don't know because it was a gift and it has a zipper opening that I've already unzipped and just to show you this this has clasp bracelets or necklaces and another area for rings or bracelets another little area here that you can put little studs or bracelets or necklaces um, this is really neat because it comes right out and when you open it up I love the way it says Pandora on there and when you open it up it has an area to put rings. And I hope that will to be my next thing that I uh, purchase in the Pandora world. <laughs> now this is a zippered pocket. If you have something small and or delicate and you don't want it to get lost, you can put it in there. And then these are pockets. And then this is another area. And I'm going to show you the bracelets in just about a minute. And I like the way it has these little clasps, clasps, so it really keeps the bracelets um, intact. And it's raised here, so like the bracelet would go like that. I don't want to tighten it for you because then I'll have one heck of a time getting it loose. Okay, now let me try to straighten this really good. Okay, this is um, one of their... Uh, what are these called again? <laughs> Bangles, that's it. I don't know the, the inch or di diameter. Um, you'll just uh, have to look on the Pandora website. And I also really um, advise that you go to a Pandora store or a place that sells Pandora, like uh, Nordstrom sells Pandora. I'm not sure what other stores do. Um, that way you can kind of try on sizes and see what you like. And then if you wanted to order things online, it it's just a little bit easier. Uh, this is so pretty. It's, it's plain, but it's just elegant. And I don't think I'm ever going to put any charms on it because I really just like it how it is. Put it over there. Now this is the leather cord. And this is twisted, as you can see there in the detail. And it has this clasp. And I love their clasps because I like the way that turns around and, and it makes it quite easy or easier to get a bracelet on. Um, having arthritis and uh, you know other little things, it, sometimes it's hard to get clasps hooked on jewelry and these are quite easy. Now this bracelet itself was the first bracelet that I received. Uh, minus these uh, charms and I received this one along with a puffed heart which is right here and that's the puffed heart and I received that from my husband uh, long story short he had an anniversary at work and they uh, for significant ones they will give you a catalog and you pick out a gift and he was so sweet and amazing and he saw a Pandora bracelet so he picked that out this one minus this um, and the pop tart was already on it uh, to give to me as a gift so I thought that was really sweet now these pieces here I received this past Christmas and this is a beautiful, beautiful charm. I It's very fancy, but I wear it just about anywhere. It has a nice size, as you can see there, a Swarovski crystal. And then there's round little Swarovski crystals all around. I love the way they have that little detail here where it sort of looks like little holes, but they're really like a... Uh, like a sideways square like a diamond yeah like a diamond um and then these i think they're called clasps they are so pretty they have such detail all around 
and the camera here is picking up pretty good so that makes me happy um, so pretty and I'm glad I decided to put these on this bracelet because they stick on there nice and unlike the charms they move around and they would always get caught in like here this detail on this bracelet and then I'd be like shaking my hand shaking my hand trying to get it you know to get them loose so recently I put them on this newer bracelet and this is a bracelet that has the round clasp and as all of them have it says Pandora there and let me show you the charms I have and do a little explanation and I hope I'm talking loud enough um, this is the heart with uh, the little hole for the key and then it has a little tiny chain and a little tiny key and the key has a heart on the top you can see that right there that's perfect and that is just so sweet now this one here has a Swarovski crystal pink and then a pave setting of Swarovski crystals all around and I love this one it was I believe a limited edition now this next one is a cupcake and it's just so adorable um, love cupcakes and I just um, my husband bought me this one at Christmas time he bought me a bunch of charms and the bracelets minus the one that I got before but anyway uh, he bought me these two bracelets no these three these three and a bunch of charms and one of the charms he picked out was this cupcake and I just love it the detail on Pandora jewelry is just it's just amazing now this next charm or spacer I forget what these are called um, is so cute I love it it says sweet sister and it has an edge all around that are tiny little hearts and it has a little attachment and that is a real tiny 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 diamond right there right there and I love the way they have this all the way around so pretty and I received this I actually purchased it with a uh, gift money that I received from my brother and sister-in-law and my niece for I believe it was a birthday of mine and so I chose that this is another really cute one I love purses I plan to do a handbag collection video sometime soon um, this has a little bow on the front on the back it has the detail of the purse and on the bottom it has their symbol for the Pandora it's so cute it doesn't open but it's just adorable now this next one I should just move the bracelet right this next one are two little bears a little boy bear a little girl bear she has a little dress or apron or something and they're holding a gold little heart and this is very personal this is something that um my husband and i we just love cartoon bears they're just our favorite i have a little collection of little tiny teddy bears and i've always loved them um my husband is like a teddy bear and so this is just this is us right here <laughs> it truly is now this next little um spacer and i forget what it's called um this is the angel wing i love the detail here and this has a little tiny gold heart like an outline of a heart and i can't get it straight for you there and this is very special to me this symbolizes the people that i have had in my life that i've loved very much that i have gone on to what i believe is heaven and then the next one is another special one this is a birthday cake and it has the detail of the flower on the top and then little tiny flowers all along the top 
It even has the stand that it's on and the, like the bottom of a stand. You know how they do like a scallop a lot on the bottom of cake stands? And it says, happy birthday. It says birthday and then the other side says happy. And I purchased this, I believe it was the Forum Shops in Las Vegas. You know, they have so much shopping, you, you forget. Uh, there was a Pandora store and my husband surprised me and took me to Las Vegas for my 50th birthday. And so I thought I would get, get a cake charm to always remember that. Um, the sales associate was trying to help me pick a charm and she pulled out dice and stuff because we were in Las Vegas, but the cake just meant so much more to me. The next one I'm going to show you has a, a bunch of Swarovski crystals that are clear and then on the outside they're like a lavender color. And this is a butterfly and it represents um, lupus, which if you've watched my videos before, you know that uh, I have lupus along with the other 1.7 million Americans. Plus I think it's 3.5 people around the world that have it. But anyway, this um, is the symbol of lupus and uh, it gives me courage and helps me to be strong. And I also am reminded of the people in the lupus community that have passed on and I never like to say lost their battle, um, so I won't, but they are in a better place. And uh, so that keeps me strong. I don't want to get too emotional here. Now the next charm or space or whatever is a, um, please forgive me for anybody out there that is, you know, a aficionado of Pandora. I'm just kind of getting into it and I forget the terms. This of course is the Eiffel Tower and it is just so cute. I love this charm. This I purchased the, I believe I, yes, I purchased this along with the cake piece from um, the shop in Las Vegas. Uh, we stayed at the Bellagio, which was across the street from the Las Vegas hotel. And I purchased it more because uh, going to Paris and seeing the Eiffel Tower is my dream trip. And I hope that one day my husband and I will be able to go. So that I hope to bring it there. <laughs> now the next one is a little like ball charm. It's very detailed all around and it has little Swarovski crystals and it is the symbol is the fleur de lis and I hope I'm pronouncing that right and that is the symbol uh, that they use in France and they also use it in New Orleans. There's a lot of French um, I forget the word. Uh, I, sorry, I just totally forget the word. I have a brain brain fart. <laughs> but anyway, I love that. Uh, I got that for Christmas. And it's just beautiful. And I like to place it next to the Eiffel Tower there. The next one here is the iconic Pandora shopping bag. I love the handles, the little bow. I love the bottom. It has their symbol. And I believe the back says Pandora too. With the, It's like identical to the front. So if it flips around, it doesn't matter. You still see it. Now this next one is really just so pretty. And in fact, sometimes I think maybe I would like to put this on a necklace as I just love it. This is a uh, pearl and I believe it's a, um, uh, what do you call it, freshwater pearl. And all those little squares and little tiny like triangles sort of, those are Swarovski crystals. And then there's crystals all around here on the top. And like I said, their detail is, their attention to detail is just amazing. And the back is so pretty too. You know, if it gets turned around, it's still a pretty charm. So I love that. This is really cute. I think, um, I forget what they call this, but it's little tiny hearts all attached. As you can see, um, I have a thing for hearts. Now we're back to the puppy heart. Back up a little bit there. 
the puffy heart that was my first charm on my first bracelet which was this one and this will forever be special in my heart because this reminds me of selflessness and how a person can come into your life and love you so much that they give you a gift instead of gifting their self and that's my husband he's amazing so those are my charms that I have on my charm bracelet and I, I love them they're beautiful now the next one uh, I don't know if I showed this to you yes I did I showed this to you this was the now I'm forgetting well this was the bangle and I really love that and I don't plan on putting any charms on that because I just love the simplicity yet the elegance and if you had to go someplace that you didn't really want to be overly dressed this would be perfect sorry my hands shake a little bit this would be perfect and I'm trying to get this to show you the etching or engraving of the Pandora there it is and it's so pretty and once again I'm sorry I don't have the measurements for anything but if you go on the website or go to the stores they're very helpful and this is the leather cord and this I think I'm going to um, if I find a charm that is just extraordinary I might put it on here uh, I was thinking of putting the puff one on here because that was my first charm but I'm kind of waiting to see what I want to do so that sorry is my Pandora collection um, I hope to uh, buy or receive some rings I, I think the rings are, are really pretty and um, who knows what else but uh, I'm very blessed and this in no way is a video to you know show off or anything I just want to share with you in case you want some ideas for a gift uh, there's a couple of these charms like this heart here in the middle with the pink that's a limited edition so they don't have it anymore but if you go on their website or even go in the store or go to a store that sells them like um, Nordstrom they should be able to tell you and they have the catalog and everything so I hope that you enjoy this and the next time um, you see me you will see my face thanks for watching and I'm sorry this was a little longer but I guess I went into a little oh there was one thing I wanted to tell you um, to clean these they don't really recommend that you put them in jewelry cleaner so I have purchased and sorry it's dirty from from polishing I have purchased this from a jewelry store that sells Alex and Ani bracelets because I love those too and this is to polish the Alex and Ani bracelets because they also recommend that you don't put those in a jewelry cleaner and I tried just earlier to clean this one and it came out really nice because it was getting like a little tarnish and that's just normal that's just the air and sometimes if you have a lot of acid in your system jewelry will get a little tarnish sooner but for me I think it's just the air and wearing it but these do a great job and you know what else is another idea going on 18 minutes and I was showing my I just realized that my finger was there anyway another great idea is if you have any old socks that have holes and you don't want to fix them just take the socks and put them in between like this and you can polish these this and the Alex and Anley bracelets or jewelry with those so I hope you like those tips and once again bye bye take care and hope you have a great morning evening day night whatever time of day you're watching this and uh, uh, I'll see you soon bye bye Mwah.